Good afternoon, everybody. I hope you all had a wonderful day yesterday, a wonderful Mother's Day. I just wanted to share some of the sweet gifts that I got for Mother's Day and then a couple things that um, a friend found for me at Home Goods when I wasn't there. So I'm going to start over here with the Soar Birdhouse. And I'll show you on the back. It has that darling feather. With the navy bow. And of course you Ray Dunn people know that was $20. And this Royal Crown Birdhouse is one I really didn't think I would get because it had been other places months ago, and our store never got it, and my friend called me, and she said, sent me a picture and says, you want one? And I said, yes, I do. Yes, yes, yes. So I have the Royal Crown Birdhouse, and of course, that was $20. Then she knew how crazy about Halloween we are, so she picked up this black apple to use at Halloween, and it was $4. And then up here, look at that precious bee. The little wings are made of wire, and this is something that a friend made, and it is so cute. She knows I'm bee crazy, and she knows John is truck crazy, so she made this too the back of a pickup truck with the little flag. And there was the uh, tag that she had on my bag of goodies with the B on it. And then down here, she also made the B skip with a little B on it. Then another friend, look at these adorable stacked bee, bees. Aren't they precious? I just think they're adorable. She got me that and this bee jar and this bee canister. It actually came from Marshall's. I think it was $10. And then she made this star with the little star on it. She cut them out and sewed them, and I just think it is adorable. And she also got me a little uh, yard sign, but that's already outside on the table. I forgot and took that on out. Then... Sweet Vicky, I know you've heard me talk about her. Her and Duke got me this beautiful bouquet of flowers. They came and surprised me yesterday with this beautiful bouquet. And it's in my grandmother's vase that I've had, uh, you know, for years and years. My grandmother's been gone a long time, so I called her Granny. So that's Granny's vase. And you can see there are lilies, there's stocks, and several colors of roses. And they're just beautiful, and that was so thoughtful of them. Then my daughter and her boyfriend, she knows we love Lori Mitchell, and I don't have any patriotic. So they sent this precious little Lori Mitchell. It's called Stars and Stripes, and I think it is adorable. Then she also, since she knows that I'm Ray Dunn crazy, got this book by Ray Dunn, In Pursuit of Inspiration. We have all the other books. In fact, I think Cindy's the one that got me the other books by Ray Dunn. Let me see if I can open this up just to give you an idea of some of the sketches and all in it. It's got just all kinds of pretty things in it. collections. <laughs> Y'all know I like collections. Keys. You know I love keys. So I'm looking forward to having time to sit down and look at that thoroughly. Oh, I forgot the little flag. This is another thing that uh, our friend made us. The little stars are raised out. So thank you all for being so sweet and gifting me with these wonderful things. I appreciate all of you. I appreciate each one of y'all that are watching this video 
and I hope your week has started off great. I planted flowers a lot of the time today and weeded the rest of it. So, till the next time, enjoy your evening.